Hello everyone. This is the Finnish silent auction app. So on the left here, I have an Android emulator. And on the right here, I have a iOS emulator. So this is the same app running on both of these phones. And you notice they look slightly different. That's because this was built with uh, native base, which styles uh, both for Android and iOS. So same code, but they look slightly different. They're using the native components. Um, and I just want to do a little demo of how um, everything works and what's going on here. So first this is the main screen where we have all our bids. You'll notice how these are ticking down. Um, this is the timer of when the bid expires. And then you can see who put, made the bid. So the user Bob did. Um, this is currently the iOS user. I'm logged in. So this was also, there's a log a user system for this. Um, this is the Android user. Um, you notice the Android user is the top bidder right now, but I could click on this icon um, and you'll notice a little laggy animation there. Um, the iOS is now the top bidder. And you notice how it also changes on the Android view and the number here changed as well. It's five more dollars now to show that they bid. And that's because it's using WebSockets. So everything is happening in real time. So I could go bid on this water bottle and then Android would be the top bidder. And then you'd see five more dollars here. And you'd see the both uh, the same thing on both screens. Um, so that's the really cool thing about WebSockets is all this is happening and this can spread to multiple phones. It doesn't have to be just two. And so that's how the bidding works. Um, there's also some filtering here. So um, both shows both complete and incomplete bids. And then complete just shows all the bids that are basically have been already completed and over. Um, there's a couple other screens so you can add different bids. Um, that's what this little plus button does here. If I click on that, um, it opens up this screen, which I can then fill out information for the bid. So maybe I want to sell a cat. I'm going to sell my cat for, uh, there we go. I'm going to sell my cat for $75. And then I can select when um, the uh, auction expires. So here I'm going to say tomorrow, Friday. Hit confirm, and then I can submit that. And then you can see it adds um, cat here to uh, the screen over here. And the iOS simulator is being a little slow. It's coming back to the screen um, after it's done. And then, so the other things, that's pretty much it of how the auctions work. Um, the other notable things is you can um, log in with different users and sign up. That's what these two tabs are doing here. So you can log in with different accounts and create different users. And that is the silent auction app. All this code is on GitHub and is open source if you'd like to take a look at it. Um, and if you haven't been following along with the YouTube videos, I also did a YouTube playlist. If you'd like to see how this was made, it'll be linked in the description below. So thank you guys for watching.